Can you describe the whole story in your own words? What? <laughs> <laughs> the entire story? I guess I better pee first. I'm interested in the way we tell stories about our lives, about the fact that the truth about the past is often ephemeral and difficult to pin down. Well, I guess if you could start by describing Mom in as much detail as possible. My memory of Mom is she was a fun person at parties, that she laughed loud. Michael was a private person, and Diane was not a private person. She yearned for more. She was very warm, you know, full of life. But I do think it's really interesting to look at this one thing that happened and how it's refracted in so many different ways. What I overheard was Mom saying that she was pregnant and that she wasn't sure who the father was. I was like 13 and my sister first told me, you know, your dad's probably not your real dad. I remember we talked about how you didn't look like dad and dad joked about it. Someone thought your father might be someone that mom had acted with in a play. You might want to meet up with Harry Gawkin. He can probably shed more light on the possibility of your mother having had an affair with a member of the cast. You asked him the question, have you ever heard anything about my mum having had an affair? Was it Tom or Wayne or Jeff? Was there ever anything romantic in your relationship with mum or was it always just friendship? What about you? I sat there in abject silence my God, we've been joking about all this stuff for years. Forget about me. She spent her whole life looking for love, and I remember feeling really happy that she had found love and that she'd been loved that much. Is this the tsunami she unleashed when she went? And all of us still flailing in her wake? How ironic it is that the final revelation of its aftermath have brought Sarah and I closer together. What about